Right, what's going on peeps? T's on the Free Pointers TV. What are we saying, man? Making his debut appearance <laughs> on our chat. Listen, man, no introduction needed. Another one. It's Robbie, man. How you what, doing, What are we saying, man? Good? I'm, I'm buzzing. I'm still buzzing, buzzing, man. Even though the game's finished a couple, couple hours ago now, but I'm still buzzing because yeah. that was a great performance today. Yeah. Who stood out for you in that? In that? Stood out? Yeah. Jorginho. I think I thought Jorginho today, Boston midfield, right. he was just the, the orchestrator, straight he just stood there, he just controlled everything, he told people where to go, his passing was brilliant, his pressing was brilliant, you know, he's, he used all his experience, just everything about him today, Yeah, it was just a complete midfield performance, mm. yeah, professional, professional yeah, yeah, professional did you, display, did, and I, did I was you, did wonderful. You, yeah, go on, go on. Mm. Yeah, yeah, no, that yeah. was so when the, the, back, did, I was going to... Do <laughs> 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 so you know what, right? Yeah. We'll, 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 put, we'll put it this well, way, right? If, if Party came back yeah. next week, if Party's fit next week, he doesn't get in the team for yeah, me. No. Well, Georgina yeah. would stay in because I, now it's not just one performance. He's consistently yeah. been putting in good performances in that midfield. And that combination of him and Declan Rice has been working cool. brilliantly. So it's a great problem to have, isn't it? Because, you know, last season, if Party was out, boy, I. Be thinking about turning back over and going. Home. You know what I mean? That's our vital part. People forget how vital part it was yeah. to us. Yeah. At, you know, at any so, point, sorry, at any point, Robert, did you feel like we were kind of missing Shaka as well? I know he's gone to. Yeah, I think earlier yeah. on in the season we were yeah. missing Shaka, but I think, listen, I don't think when you see the amount of goals we're scoring at the moment, mm. the way we've been destroying teams since the start of this um, year. Mm. You can't say we're missing him as well. You know what I mean? So, you know, we, we, we found a sort of new way to play. I think earlier on in the season, we were playing well. We were creating chances, but there was no fluidity to the team. But I think they found that now. Yeah. And, um, you know, 4 1 today, 5 0 last week, 6 0 the week before. 3-1 the What's week before that yeah. I mean did, 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 at any point during the game like the first maybe like 20 minutes did you feel like we kind of sh not struggling to break no, the deadlock no, no, but, no. but you knew it was going to come started the game brilliantly today because right. we, we from the start the way we pressed them the amount of errors they made from right. our press yeah. right the goal was coming it was only yeah. a matter of time to me that that goal was coming so at no time did I think did I even feel worried in that game? Yeah. We we were just exceptional today. And their form has dipped a little bit. In in Newcastle? Recent, Newcastle, would well, you say? They, they, yeah, well, they've been since the start of this year, they've been on a decent run, haven't they? So mm. they went away and beat Villa. Free, what, are people right. forgetting those yeah, things? Yeah, I've seen it. Well, I forgot. That's what, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They smashed Sheffield United 8-0. Eight, eight yeah, eight yeah, one. yeah. They, and, right. But I'm saying they went away at Villa Park and they won 3-1. Yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? They beat Forest. They, they, so, you know, they've been back on... A little run, Newcastle, but yeah. today they were not even got a sniff in the game. All right, Sheffield United ne uh, next, I do believe. Yep. How'd you see that game? Play um, like this today yeah. could be anything. <laughs> okay. It's just about, listen, just it's, him. you're, it's you're just saying 7 0 now, yeah? No, no, no. You, listen, it's the Premier League, you've got to respect every team. Right. If you go there and you're below par against a team like Sheffield United, they can hurt you. But mm. if we go and we play like tonight, we'll win. Yes, and then we've got Brentford at home. If we play like how we played tonight, we'll win that as well. So it's just about consistently yeah. playing like what we're doing today, the pressing, all that. It was brilliant. All right, we still got to go to Trafford, City, Tottenham. Can we get nine out of nine? Nine points out of nine? Maybe not necessarily yeah. nine out of nine at those places. They're difficult places to go to. Right. But, you know, we won at um, Tottenham last year. Yeah, we haven't you know, won at Trafford. We haven't won at Old Trafford. Four. We should have won there last year. We yeah. didn't. That's one we got to overcome. Um... You know, we don't know. United, we don't know. If what. we do, however, beat Man United at Old Trafford for the first time in God knows how long. It could be. Is that, you is never that know. one it of those be, ones where you be. think, you know, hold on a minute, Listen, this we, could we be don't, our year. You know, if we was to beat, you know, it's a scenario that we could go, say you went and beat a city there. And we could almost then... Have a have a game where we got to play them at Old Trafford, and if we win that, we we, we literally got our hands on the title. Yeah. Or they could stop us. Yeah. You know what I mean? So there's some tough games coming up. Yeah. There's a real. You're right. There's some real <laughs> tough games coming up. But I'm looking forward to all of them. You must. You must. It's going to be brilliant. You must be enjoying your time as an Arsenal man. And loving it. Arsenal Absolutely fan, loving finally. it. Man. We're challenging. Was what yeah. we wanted to see the manager do was get us challenging for leagues, and that's exactly what we're doing right now. We're getting. Oh, that's a good question. Yeah. Yeah. Kirill, right? So yes. when Zinchenko is fit and Otomiyasu, does Kirill keep his place? I think he probably wouldn't. 
just because I think you know um, the ex- yeah and just the solidity of especially away from him I think Tommy Asu right. but certainly at the moment listen again he's another one who's given us something to think about isn't it I'm he's been excellent Tim- what about when Timber comes back as well what <laughs> <laughs> these are problems we want to have <laughs> yeah. listen right. man thank you for your yeah, time right, Robbie nice um, if you mind hailing up the three pointers TV because we only we got here. three pointers man yeah man three points tonight <laughs> hey. come on peeps what were you waiting for like share subscribe to the three pointers